I'm Mila Laura with our guest for this morning, Ms. Rowena Mati of Galileo Enrichment Learning Program. Okay, Rowena, you were telling me before the start of the show that there's this new method when it comes to math called the Singapore math. Ano naman yan? Um, this is the latest trend now. Oh. A lot of, um, there's a survey that they call TIMS. It's Trends in International Mathematics and Science Study. Mm -hmm. so it's a test given to countries that would like to join it. Ah, okay. So sometimes 60 countries join it. Sometimes 60? Oh. Marami, no? Marami, okay. Oh. Mm -hmm. um, and we joined it once. Mm -hmm. you know? So when we joined it in 2003, for grade school, out of 25 countries, oh. number 23 times. Out of you 25, know. number 23 tayo. Oh. Then so, the, second from the bottom. Yeah. And then <laughs> sa high school, mm. 34th out of 38. So, wow. so really mm. bad. No? Oh. So, when they had it again in 2000, they have it every four years. Oh. Hindi muna tayo sumali. 2008, the Philippines decided to join. Mm -hmm. But we joined yung advanced mathematics. Okay. You join as an individual or as your country. school as, as a, a country. country. Yes. So you coordinate this thing with that. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. mm. And then um, in 2008, out of advanced math, so ibig sabihin yan, students from the Philippine Science Schools. Uh -huh. Out of ten countries, number ten tayo. Just <laughs> ko iyak na ba yung sa akin, bro? That's why the educators oh. are really um, trying to do everything. Uh -huh. Pero they're really working on it. Naman. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know because I attend seminars oh. and I get to talk to them. Mm -hmm. Everyone is really trying to do something about it. Mm -hmm. The latest now is Singapore math. Mm -hmm. Even the United States, uh, a, lo um, a lot of um, places in the States now have Singapore math. Mm -hmm. They even have conferences, Singapore math conferences. Really? Uh, because um, since they discovered yeah, that Singapore has been topping this test, this oh. survey, mm -hmm. Educators are really looking at how they do it. It's mm -hmm. really just called Singapore math because it's how the Singaporeans teach their math mm -hmm. as mandated by the government. Mm -hmm. So the curriculum, the materials they use, mm -hmm. uh, you, that's what they call Singapore math. Mm -hmm. okay. So in the Philippines, um, Ateneo started using it six years ago. Mm -hmm. Ika and Xavier followed after that. Um, this year, Miriam, College and Assumption, San Lorenzo, mm -hmm. will be teaching it from grade one. Um, a lot of other schools are adopting mm -hmm. um, the minimum preparatory. What you're telling me are the private schools. Yes. Uh, what about those in the public schools? Um, it would be good if they be able to get it. Kaya lang ang problema ngayon, the books that are being used are expensive because it comes from Singapore. Ah, they like yeah. how much? Um, if I ano ba to? Since you you teach kids from three years of age uh -huh. up to twelve, no, great uh, three years old, may mga math math na yon, simple oh, math. Yes. Oh. Oh, oh. Even this Singapore math is applied in yes. teaching these kids. Oh, oh. Because the hmm, idea talaga. is, ang maganda sa Singapore math oh. is CPA, concrete, pictorial, and abstract. Mm. Kasi before the usual way that we learn math is you start first with counting, then oh. one, two, three, four. Hindi na intindihan ng bata kung anong one, mm -hmm. kung anong two, anong three, di ba? Mm -hmm. For them to understand it, you should give them an object and tell them, this is one. Mm -hmm. This is one apple. One ball. Uh oh, this mm -hmm. is one ball. Mm -hmm. So that's how they do it in Singapore math. They start with concrete objects. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that's how they do it um, pataas. Mm -hmm. Even the topics per level are less mm -hmm. so that they can master it first before going on to the higher levels. Mm -hmm. What the topics are taught? Um, kaya lang compared to how we teach it here in the Philippines, ang dami daming topics. Sa akin, if you, memo, uh, you just memorize, oh, no? Yung just, sa uh, likod ng notebook, one time is one uh, equals one, uh, one uh, time is two equals two. Oo. Oh, eh, pag minemorize mo, oh. mahirap maintindihan. Oo, oh, oh, hindi rin na ano oh. ng bata oh. eh. So, ito, hmm. they make sure that they understand the concept. Oo. Oh. Before going on to higher math. So, sometimes, hmm. problem solving okay. na pala yung ginagawa nila. Oo. Oh. Hindi pa nila alam. Kasi nga, I'm um, broken down into pieces of things that you I remember when I was young, I think I was in grade four. That was the time we had long division. Talaga, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. And the carry, 
Oh, yung mga carry-carry. Lahat carry. may nilalagay yung carry dun sa oh. class, di ba? Mm-hmm. So ito, they really understand through objects, through materials, napapakita sa bata, why do you have to carry? Oo. Oh. What happens when you add? Oo. Oh. They even have a parang balance beam. Oo. Oh. Na kinukompare yung numbers. One, is this heavy? If you put two here, mas ma- heavy yun. Mm. Okay. Kung two yung nandito, that's two ones. Mm. So they really see it. Mm. So they really understand it before you go to the abstract of numerals. Nga, eh, nga, nga, eh. Yeah. eh, kaso ano nangyayari minsan? Basta pinababayaan ng bata, okay. You memorize this. Memorize, yes. Oh, and then after that, wala na. At saka pag memorize, madali makalimutan. Oo. Oh, oh. If you understand it, you'll never forget. Mm. We'll talk more about this in the format, no? After this song coming from the letterman, Love Me With All Your Heart. Welcome back to Mornings with Anne. I'm Mila Laura with our guest for this morning, a very beautiful lady, Miss Rowena Mati of Galileo Enrichment Learning Program. Okay, Rowena. You're telling me that this coming October, you're going to have a festival, uh, the first Singapore math conference in the Philippines. Yeah, I'd like to invite everyone to attend this very in, uh, special event. Mm-hmm. In Galileo, kasi we, have, we do events for parents and educators. Okay. So this will be a big one. Mm-hmm. It will be on October 8, 2011. Where? It's 9 to 5, AIM Conference Center in Makati. Mm-hmm. Um, the title is Singapore Math Festival. Mm. This is the very first Singapore Math Conference in the Philippines. So it's brought to them by Galileo together with Ed Krish, Marshall mm-hmm. Cavendish, the, the distributors of the books okay. of Singapore. Who are your guests for this particular uh, festival? Um, we have Dr. Aquina Di Chua and her son Scott Di Chua. Mother and son? Yes, mother okay. and son. They're really promoting Singapore math because Scott started to learn Singapore math when it was introduced in Xavier. Mm-hmm. And um, the way they do it, uh, we had seminars already informing parents about Singapore math. Um, the son explains how he understands math mm-hmm. and how he learned it using okay. the Singapore method. And then the mom also gives the um, a certain theory also. Mm-hmm. And then we have Dr. Yak Banhar. Mm-hmm. He's um, a professor and the author of the Singapore Math Books. Mm, so he's okay. coming here to share his knowledge to schools who are interested to adopt it, mm-hmm. parents who are interested just to know about Singapore Math. So it's a whole day affair. Yes. Mm-hmm. So in the morning, it's going to be Banhar and Queen Ali and the Sun. Mm-hmm. And then we're going to have breakout sessions in the afternoon. Oh. So there are ano Parents as well as their kids are welcome to attend. Um, no, we just uh, in, we just invite the adults. So ah, adults, lang. Uh, adults lang. So mm-hmm. parents, educators, and those oh, are interested. interesting. Okay, before we uh, before I give the last song for the show, no, why don't you invite our listeners? Um, I'd like to invite everyone first um, to attend uh, Galileo classes in our different centers. We have twenty three branches all over Metro Manila. And we have provincial branches, as I mentioned earlier, mm-hmm. Subic, Lucena, Dumaguete, mm-hmm. and Laguna. And your contact numbers? Um, our contact number is very easy to remember, 845-1234. 845-1234? Yes. Hindi ka maliligaw. And then we website? also have a website, mm-hmm. um, GalileoEnrichment.com. Mm-hmm. We're also in Facebook and in Twitter. Ah, okay. And then, uh, to this, I invite the listeners to the Singapore Math Festival. Yeah, I'd like to invite everyone to uh, um, get to know more about the latest trend in math education in the Philippines. Mm-hmm. This is actually changing the landscape of teaching math in the Philippines. Mm-hmm. Um, Singapore Math Festival that will be on October 8, 9 to 5 at the AIM Conference Center. Okay. And to close the show, we have this song coming from Linda Ronstadt. Someone to watch over me. Ay, nako. When I learned a lot from you this morning. Huh? And thank you very much for coming over to the program. Thank you very much for inviting me. Okay. Well, friends, thank you very much for listening and have a happy weekend. Bye.